Hello and welcome everyone. This is the new RunCam Wi-Fi Link Air Unit which is based on Open IPC digital APP system. Today I am going to unbox it and we will go through some initial setup procedure. So let's uh, look into So this is inside a VTX and a camera. So you can see this is the Wi-Fi board. This has output power of 29 dBm which is roughly 800 milliwatt. And they have introduced some kind of pads but this is too thick to be a good thermal conductive pad the two antenna power cable now uh, I'm going to install the antenna first to before power it on. There. So for this initial powering, I'm going to use one of my the same JST connector. I have just installed a XT30 to power it directly uh, through my CS line. But uh, directly powering this is not recommended since I am testing it on bench. Uh, it is okay. So this is only the video transmitter section or the air unit. For the video receiver, you need to use USB Wi-Fi adapter based on the Realtek 8812 chipset. So there are many adapters like uh, you can use this Tenda or a high-end Alpha adapters for this. And uh, you can view the transmission on your Android mobile tablet or you can use it also with your laptop and for your goggles you need to use this Ratsa 03W in combination with the Wi-Fi adapter so um, before starting we need to install the memory card do this And let's install the power cable. So make sure the polarity is correct. Now, as per manual, we need to power it on and uh, some specific files gonna save into the SD card. So let's power it on. Okay, let's start it. And now let's power it off 
now the specific file should be set onto the SD card. Let's take out the SD card. And plug into the I'm going to plug into the computer. So we got two files gs key gs dot key and user so as per instruction we need to copy this gs dot key to our android phone so i'm going to copy this file to my phone Now just copy. Okay. Now there is another file. So this is opening in notepad and you can change the parameters and set the values according to your need so this is set on channel 173 uh, available values tx power 55 so i'm not going to touch anything for this setup now insert the sd card back okay. if you uh, go through the instruction show you the instruction on the runcam website you can see the two app download link one is pixel pilot and one is APVU both for Android so you can go through this page and download the APK and install it on your mobile device okay so I have already installed it. Let me show you. So this is the Pixel Pilot I have already installed. Let's open it. And uh, you can see no compatible Wi Fi adapters are found. I have not uh, actually connected any Wi Fi adapter. So let's connect. So as I said earlier, we can use any Realtek 8812 chipset based Wi-Fi adapters so currently let's use this tender there are lots of this kind of adapter available online so and I'm going to use a little USB to USB-C adapter and let's connect it Now you can see this is saying starting WAP channel 161 but I guess uh, this is set to 173 so but before that first we need to locate the GS key okay so first located the GS dot key now Let's select the channel 173. Close it and start it again. Now this is searching channel 173. Okay, so now let's power it on. So it is started.
okay so we got the transmission image is also looking good so if you want to use this with your goggles then you need to use the RAPSA 0 w and I will cover it in the next video let me show you the there is a latency but not too bad you can start recording from here so here is the phone folder Hello. so it's currently recording and let's check the weight of this thing so it's coming at 36 gram so that's for today please stay tuned for the next video until then Goodbye and thanks for watching.